Baby, I'm holy. Shorty, you gon' be left with your heart broke. Your friends think I'm gorgeous, feel like an artist. Time to get sold in an all show. I pulled up the last five nights, calling my Ubers like usual, huh? Girl, get a clue, you read a room. You the next boatload of cargo, huh? Watch me. Alright guys, so as you guys can see, we are in my second slot character again. It's because I wanted to show you guys one of the tricks that I learned to level up fast as a newbie in the game. And by using this method, I can guarantee you guys that you can reach a lot of level and you can progress much more easier than dying multiple times right here. So if you're playing solo, then this will literally help you guys out. So let's go ahead and create our stats. Now right here, I will leave all the stuff that you guys needed. I'm just gonna jump to the point for here. I'm gonna be using a starting weapon. You can use any weapon that you want, but in this uh, tutorial, I'm gonna be using a, um, a dagger. Uh, it's just, I'm kinda used into it now. But anyways, uh, just let's go ahead to the boons and flaws. All right, so for the boons and flaws right here, I don't highly suggest to follow this build since this is the build that I'm using right now. So I will show you guys my build right here. If you wanna level up fast, you can also use this build right here same as mine but you can uh, still you know customize it if you want so the first thing that we needed just is the auto detect this will also help you guys level up so as you guys can see uh, you get a free attribute to invest every level I will show you guys how it works later on and also I'm gonna be playing as a solo right here so I'm gonna be using the Maverick okay so for greater experience so yeah I'm a solo player so if you don't usually play in solo then I suggest to pick a different uh, you know boons and flows right here. Now before you finalize the character, go ahead and pick the starting island, go to Isle of Vigils. We're not gonna be going to Etria this time, okay? Now once you spawn in, go ahead and outside and talk to this lady to get the free money right here we need the free money right here to start the buy our starting equipment okay once that's done all you gotta do is just head over to the temple right over there and once you get to the temple of approach uh, just follow the staircase all the way up here so yeah just go to the side uh, don't mind the guards they won't really necessarily attack you and look at that some people are just getting <laughs> beat up right there but anyways right here guys we go to the left side and right here we go down I think I'm going the wrong way okay right here mm -hmm. just follow all the way this uh, you know area right here everybody and go down here in here and we should be in the trainer spot so here's the trick everybody so we are level one right so what we got to do guys is get fortitude up to 20 to 30 depending on the stats that you want to build so right here let's see how much we can get fortitude right here we will build this up all the way up to 20s okay now first let's use our starting money right here to buy the training vest let's use that there we go and go ahead and talk to this person right here and we will be able to do the uh, sparring with the instructor now just go ahead and use the vest and let him hit you okay bam okay there you go it will we will level up every time he hit us okay there you go for fortitude now we will just keep doing this again and again okay now for this i'm gonna be speed forwarding it real quick Alright, so once you will start seeing this, I've learned what I can do from training right now. I should put it into practice. Now just go ahead and start an actual sparring with the instructor. Go ahead and use your uh, sword or whatever. So I have a dagger right here. Let's go ahead and fight this uh, NPC uh, to gain some EXP with different uh, stats right here. Okay, oh, I just get wrecked. Uh, let's go ahead and do that again, shall we? Okay, spar. Okay, uh, he will attack me. Bam, bam, bam. Uh, attack me. Okay, okay. Uh huh, there you go. Oh, uh, sorry about that. Um, okay. Ah, okay, there you go. Fortitude increase again, everybody. Now just go ahead and use that. We need experience as well. Uh-huh. Okay, it's okay. I'm getting killed right there. Uh, uh, as you guys can see, some people are already doing it since it's like the secret method like nobody uses. As you guys can see, if you start using the vest, it still won't let us. Now don't worry, once we get to power level 2, we will be able to. Okay, let's just go ahead and speed forward and start uh, just doing parry and with the uh, boss right here. So let's do that uh, again.
Now, as you guys can see, we have a thunder color now. So that's a very, very good help, okay? And let's just keep doing this, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, I think it's like uh, we're done. So, as you guys can see, we are now in power 2. Now, let's go ahead and use that. And let's go ahead and get our first uh, mantra right here. So, we got a Jolt Growl, which I don't really like at the moment. But uh, let's just go for uh, Mystery Mantra. Hopefully, I get the thing that I needed. Okay, finally, I got the Lightning Blade. This is what I needed. Okay, there you go. Let's go ahead and use the Jumbo as well. Oh, no, no, no. We're not going to be using that. Sorry about that. Now, we're in the Power 2 right here. I hope that we can use this right here, but we don't have a Flint. Now, let's just keep doing this until we can use uh, the Vest again. Okay, so that's the first time we defeated the instructor. But anyways, uh, we can now start using the vest again now. We just have to speed forward this until we reach up to uh, 4320 above, okay? So I highly recommend to get like 20 plus fortitude because it's gonna be useful in the next step, okay? So yeah, let's just keep doing this and yeah, I'm gonna speed forward it. Alright, so uh, it looks like I ran out of hunger. Now, if you don't really want to end up like me, make sure you stack up some food. Now, at some point, we reach fortitude of 25. I don't really care if I die at this point since I'm just going to be ended up uh, leveling up uh, anytime soon, okay? Okay, so for some reason, I lost my uh, training vest. It looks like it worn out. I already used too much of it. So probably it got broken. Now I'm just gonna finish this last fight right here. Okay, never mind. I lost the fight, but uh, it's okay. So we get to 4226. So uh, I think this is already more than enough. So, and also, like I said, I don't really care dying earlier. It's because I already got my uh, life back right there. So uh, let me just get this. I don't know what is this probably element. Oh, no, never mind now. Okay, let me see. Swim fast. Sir, I need this okay so now that we are done leveling our fortitude now we are officially going to be leaving this island we're going to be living through the uh Etris, uh right there so uh, we're going to be leaving this uh you know isle of vigils right here we don't want to leave here because uh i don't you know, i don't know man i just don't like it here but uh yeah anyway it's still up to you but for me we're going to be setting sail to Etris and we will get some cash right there i will show you guys how now just go ahead and to the zip line right here and we will reach the dock instantly there we go now, mm -hmm. now let me just go ahead and get some water real quick there we go and yeah let's go ahead and travel to the uh, itrus And so we officially arrived to the land of Itris, everybody. So, uh, yeah, anyways, uh, let's go ahead to the top real quick. So once you are in the top, just go ahead and talk to this guy at the middle. And he will give you the free golden ring right here, everybody. So what we're going to do with this uh, golden ring is we sell it to this guy right here. 
and then he should be able to give us 25 notes now what i usually do is just buy the lumber axe and pickaxe i really suggest to make some money first before you get confused uh, of having no money anymore just go ahead and buy flint just in case for campfire and stuff like that now first thing before you go adventure you don't want to respawn in isle of vigils again and it is too far just go ahead to this inn and then we will talk to this guy right here and then we will stay in this uh, place there you go now that we are staying here you have to pay for five notes by the way now you can go ahead and start your real adventure now right here guys this um, guide won't be really that long I'm just gonna be showing you guys the basic and you guys will continue that again and again and adventure with your friends or you can continue doing um, you know uh, solo adventuring and yeah go ahead and level it up because I don't really want to spoil it to you guys every single thing right here so yeah go ahead and explore enjoy the game that's how I learn all of these stuff as well and yeah basically I will show you guys one more last tip what you guys need to do and just go ahead and you know uh, what do you call this uh, you know um, do uh, what, what you want to do in your own way once you see this last step right here because this last step will show you um, how you level up uh, any stuff right here you get and how you get started basically we can get up to level 10 right here after this so mm -hmm. and here we go we are now in Eurasia all you gotta do is just head over to the left side of the gate and we will now start uh, farming the uh, this uh, mud skipper right here uh, I mean that's what they call them I don't know what's the exact name but yeah anyways uh, so they will start spawning in this area as long as no one's farming them they should definitely spawn if they're not spawning yet okay there you go they start spawning uh, to block this is just go ahead and time it out correctly and uh, okay there you go oh oh there you go oh what um there you go <laughs> okay now uh, don't be afraid everybody you are now pretty strong already since of the fortitude training that we got so you should have not be afraid to die okay because look at this fortitude we have 26 right here and that's more than enough and don't worry if they jump on you at the same time like if they spawn on you like a lot of them don't be afraid they're very very easy to kill as long as you know what you're doing okay so as you guys can see easy peasy now this is our main purpose of why we train right there everybody so what you gotta do right here is gather as much as money as you got to sell it and buy equipment so we need equipment to level up our uh, strength fortitude agility any else all of this stuff and especially the weapon right here now uh yeah there you go uh, they will just keep spawning don't be afraid like i said just go ahead and parry that and do the combo and stuff like that they're very very easy to kill everybody trust me just get used in the blocking and stuff then you're good to go you know what i'm saying uh-huh uh -huh. there you go very easy just block that there you go even though i don't have that much uh, power in my weapon we can still kill them easy easy mm -hmm. there you go usually i can 1v5 them like okay, there you go uh-huh okay i'm lagging now usually i'm just so laggy bro like oh my god okay there you go mm -hmm. sometimes my internet is interrupting me there you go don't worry about that it's very easy trust me there you go there you go, there you go, easy. So once you get all of them, just go ahead and start gripping them. There you go, man. Mm -hmm. Oh, this guy's helping me, thank you. And well, uh, anyways, there's more right here. Just go ahead and kill all of them, because they are EXP. Mm -hmm. There you go, there you go. Oh, <laughs> he's, got, he's ganked up. I don't know if he can know how to defeat him, but it looks like he's having trouble right there, boys. Oh, we'll see. We'll help him out in a bit. Uh, okay, only one. Oh, this guy's having trouble. Let's just help him. I got you, man. Uh -huh. Oh, okay, there you go. One combo. <laughs> it's okay, man. There you go. There you go. Easy. So, as long as you're not <laughs> really used to it, trust me guys you will get used to it hey look at that if you don't know how to time it out correctly don't panic you will know how to uh, you know block it so look at this just time it out okay block here okay oh he attack it never mind you guys very easy <laughs> thank you oh no problem man there you go so as you guys can see these things are keep popping out we need the equipment okay oh uh, okay this the chest just spawn and looks like you looted it all no okay we got a silver ring oh we're gonna sell that anyways
So yeah, anyway, so just go ahead and follow this guide right here. Now, as you guys can see, we are now at power 11. And yeah, if you keep doing this again and again, you can basically, um, what do you call this, master this type of leveling. So basically, just study the NPCs and stuff like that. It will take some time, but once you master it, trust me, it's going to be very, very easy. So if you enjoyed this video, guys, make sure to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell on for more awesome videos like this. So you guys as always, thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Peace out.